Hey, it's a me, Pao, and today I would like to talk to you about an oil painting, The Garden of Earthly Delights by Jerome Bush. Before known as Hieronymus Bush's triptych, one of his most complex and enigmatic creations. It was painted between 1490 and 1510, when Bush has between 40 and 60 years old. This painting is considered a commission work. When the triptych's wings are closed, it shows the world during creation, probably on the third day, after the addition of plant life, but before the appearance of animals and humans. The left panel of the triptych depicts a scene from the paradise of the Garden of Eden, commonly interpreted as the moment when God presents Eve to Adam, the only humans on that panel. So here they are, God presenting Eve to Adam in the Garden of Eden. There is a unicorn here, so I just... <laughs> it's so pretty! There is a lot of birds, like, everywhere. Not just here in the paradise. Like, everywhere. <laughs> a lot of birds. At the center is completely madness. Full of animals, plants, people, and giant fruits of all sorts, mystical creatures, and weird, enormous structures. Very oniric. There is a lot of fruits. Like, this giant strawberry, so big, it's like the size of his body. <laughs> and this, this just reminds me of Jurassic Park. It's just that there is a lot of things going on, it's so freaking mad. <laughs> the right panel illustrates hell. Bush depicts a world in which humans have succumbed to temptations that leads to evil and reap eternal damnation. The panel strikes a hard contrast to those preceding it. It's darker and the scene is set at night. The panel of hell, it's, well, hell. <laughs> He's sitting in a toad, like, what? <laughs> having dinner. And these mutant rats having dinner too. Bubble butt music. At the top of the panel, we can see there's a lot of war going on, a lot of battles and death. And um, yeah. I find this painting fascinating, with a very strong visual impact. You always find something new every time you see it, overflowing with symbolic elements everywhere, so every detail has a meaning. I can admire it for hours, it's really funny and it just gives chills to my soul. 